WRTV Streaming News is sponsored by Tom Wood Group. From Indy's Streaming News Leader, this is a WRTV update. Good afternoon, I'm Megan Shin, and here's a look at your top stories. Gunfire claimed the lives of three more people in Indianapolis over the weekend. The most recent happened last night on Indy's north side. Around 7.20 p.m., officers responded to a report of a person shot in the 7300 block of Railhead Court. That's located near 75th Street and Hague Road. When officers arrived, they say they found no victims, but they did find evidence of a shooting. They learned someone left the scene with a shooting victim in a private vehicle. Officers found the vehicle and followed it to communicate Community North Hospital. The man who was shot was last reported in critical condition. While working on the case, police learned about another shooting victim who was brought to a community facility as well. But that person died at the hospital. He is now identified as 18-year-old Karan Hopkins. Police returned to the Rail Hook Court area where they found several guns and detained multiple people. Investigators say both victims were shot at that location and the investigation continues. Now to Indy South Side, that's where IMPD reports today. Six people were shot outside of GZ Club in the 5900 block of Madison Avenue. One person died. This all happened just before 1.30 Sunday morning. Officers found five victims in the parking lot. One man died at the scene. The coroner identified him today as 23-year-old Samuel Ling. Today, IMPD reports there's now a fifth person who was injured in that shooting. A man who walked into St. Francis Hospital. Witnesses say there was some sort of disturbance inside of the club just before the shooting began. Several nearby businesses had bullet damage and multiple firearms were located. So far, no one is in custody. Around the same time in the shooting on the south side, another shooting took place on Indy's west side. This one happened in the first block of Edwin Court. That's in a neighborhood between 30th Street and the Indianapolis Motor Speedway. Today, we learned 17-year-old Luis Garcia died in that shooting. Two 28-year-old men were stable when taken to the hospital. Detectives believe the shooting stemmed from a disturbance between one or more individuals from one group and one or more individuals from another group. Todd? All right, temperatures will be running above normal here as we work our way throughout the next couple days. In fact, uh, a few of these days will get close to the record high. Record high for today is 77. That's the bar here in the red. Today we're probably in the lower 70s and the best chance may be on Wednesday as we climb into the mid to upper 70s, uh, but the record high uh, for that day is uh, 79 degrees. Uh, either way you look at it, whether we hit the record or not, still nice and mild for this time of year. Get out and enjoy temperatures today. Again, between 70 and 75 degrees. It will be a little windy this afternoon with some gusts up to 30 miles per hour. And then for your election day tomorrow, Tomorrow, partly cloudy skies, still a little breezy and high temperatures. It'll be right around 70 degrees.